Helen, um, we've spoken before previously about all of your experience within mobile, but we're not going to talk about that because you're, you're actually the founder of Heroes of the Mobile Fringe. And I just wanted to, it's an interesting initiative, and I'd just love to hear a little bit more about it. Sure. Well, it started because of my love of Mobile World Congress. Uh, it's a show I've been going to for many years in Barcelona. I've always organised side events while I've been there. I've always done like a ladies' lunch, done the Swedish beers, mobile networking party, I've usually done a panel session or two, and I have friends who do similar things. And it's like, well, that's kind of a fringe festival, isn't it? Yeah. Um, and what I wanted to do was create opportunities for smaller companies and different types of businesses to get some airtime, really, and to find the people that they need to connect with and meet by creating more focused opportunities and smaller opportunities. I mean, Mobile World Congress is amazing. It's huge. Yeah, and it and, is huge, but, isn't it? But it's yeah. huge. And very corporate. And it's kind of very, it's very you know, about big companies. Yeah, and, yeah. and you arrive, and for the first 20 minutes, it's like, wow, this is amazing. And then it suddenly all kind of merges into one, and it all kind of looks the same. So what I wanted to do was give people permission to do their own thing. So it wasn't all about having the big stand and having making the big noise. You can make a small noise and still make the connections you need to. Because ultimately, you only have a certain amount of time anyway in your day. You can only meet a certain amount of people. So I'm just creating a different way to network. And what I found is that even I find networking daunting still. And I'm quite an experienced networker. Yeah. If you like. I've been doing it for a lot of years. But the reason I can do it is because I organise my own events or I get involved in other people's events. So when I started out networking, I always volunteered. And I always volunteered for the registration desk because then I would know everyone who came through yeah. the door and I yeah. could say hello and then pick up, oh, I might want to go and speak to that person afterwards. And so again, it's an opportunity for people to get involved, not necessarily running their own event, but helping with other events to give them an excuse to go and talk to other people. By having a role at an event, you have permission to talk. Absolutely. And where can people go to find out more about Heroes of uh, the Bar Well, the, the next Fringe Festival will be in Barcelona in February 2014. You can find out about it at mobileheroes.net. But I'm also organising other Fringe events around the world throughout the year in different cities around various different topics. So just get in touch with me. And if you want to do something in your city, then let me know. Helen Keegan, thank you very much. Thanks, Rob.